Hey guys, so today I am just going to go ahead and show off Cyanogen Mod 9, uh, the release candidate 2 for the Samsung Galaxy S3 uh, as we have here on the left side and then uh, on my right side I have my Samsung Galaxy Nexus running uh, the Fisher under 4.1 so let's just go ahead and compare these two updates so uh, what's the big difference here between these two uh, versions of Android first of all uh, the Galaxy Nexus is running uh, Android 4.1 uh, the official update as you do know there is no official Android 4.1 right now for the Galaxy S3 uh, and of course uh, Cyanogen Mod 9 uh, is not rocking on Android 4.1 uh, uh, Cyanogen Mod 10 is rocking on Android 4.1 uh, but uh, Cyanogen Mod 9 is still Android 4. Point, let's see could it be the latest update? 4.0.4 uh, or 4.0.3 let's go ahead and go down Go to about phone. Uh, Four point point four. Uh, quickly compare that to uh, the version over here. About phone. You can see it's rocking on Android four point one. So pretty big difference there. Uh, so it's the Jelly Bean update on the Galaxy Nexus version of Sunogen One Nine uh, release candidate two. So what is the big update with the Jelly Bean? Well, it's of course that it's quicker. You can really feel that they have improved the speed just yes, by doing it like this and you should know that the Galaxy S3 here on the left side it's quad core uh, but it feels more smooth uh, on the Galaxy Nexus pretty crazy uh, yes it's it's very very insane how how quick it is and, and the Galaxy Nexus has been out for soon a year you know so really really impressive update there with Android 4.1 uh, also here is of course the biggest difference when you go into the app drawer and do it like this you can really 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 see that it's it's like twice the performance you know you can really feel that you know Google didn't lie when they said that they improved the uh, updates so much uh, in Android 4.1 in you know how, how smooth it is you can really feel it okay so let's just go ahead and launch some apps here um, let's see I, I should already have a few apps open up in the background so I'm just gonna go ahead and close them all and something that I like with TouchWiz over here is that you can quickly clear all of the apps that's open up but you can't do it here in the stock experience uh, okay so let's go ahead and launch uh, this one on both you did see it was a little bit quicker there uh, on my galaxy phone and as you can see I have another phone over here so I'm just gonna go ahead and try to take a picture uh, of my galaxy phone my main galaxy phone you'll be able to see over here let's go ahead and quickly do it like this maybe So a little bit different there in the animations and things. Uh, if you go ahead and go to the home, you did see that you know they really have some amazing speeds here in uh, the Android 4.0 Jelly Bean experience. So you know you just imagine the Galaxy S3 uh, with Jelly Bean when it's going to be out. Uh, but Samsung Gear 9, you know, if you still want Android 4.1 right now, try out the Jelly Bean experience on like the Galaxy S3. You can go ahead and do so right now uh, with Cyanogen Mod 10 and I have shared off in a video uh, but it's still kind of buggy, kind of glitchy uh, there's a lot of things that uh, isn't really working right now uh, but you know if you really want the stable Cyanogen Mod 9 experience you should definitely go ahead and check out uh, Cyanogen Mod 9 uh, release candidate 2 right now uh, there are some you know, install instructions in the x developers forum and release candidate uh, of course means that it, it's a stable bill basically so but you know under 421 jelly bean with galaxy nexus it's still faster uh, but yeah and of course we have the touch with experience over here in the middle and actually I gotta say that the touch with experience is kind of nice over here uh, with this uh, you know uh, when you drag it down like this uh, you get way more options in touch with you know that you have so many more options up here in the latest update that you can go ahead and customize
this very, very easily. You can have it on auto. You can quickly go ahead and go to settings. It is a little bit better, I gotta say. I think it's a little bit more, uh, you know, better optimized than so Nogi Mod 9 RC2. Uh, and uh, you know, under 41 Jelly Bean here, the, the, the real hardcore GUI Android experience. Uh, so, you know, I, I like TouchWiz, I like TouchWiz. So, I'm just gonna end this video here. Use the quick, quick first look here on Sanogma 9 RC2. And of course, it's a web of a way many, you know, for, for a ton of other phones as well. Uh, but yeah, have an awesome day, and I'll see you all in the next video. Hopefully, bye bye.